Hi friends, in this video, I'm gonna fix an industrial switch mode power supply. So without further ado, let's start this video. If you haven't subscribed, then do subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon so you can get notification whenever I upload a new video. You can follow me on Facebook and Instagram. I have a second channel, Canny Tech. Do check it out, subscribe and support it. So here is the power supply. Let's power it up first. As you can see, the LED on the supply is not stable. It's a kind of blinking and there is a clicking sound too. Let me set my multimeter and see if output is stable or not. As you can see the output is not stable. Let's connect a load and test it again. The output voltages are not stable. They are going up and down. Let's open up the supply and see what is the problem. Everything seems okay, there is no burnt component and leaky capacitor. These supplies have a feedback system which stabilizes the output voltages under different conditions. There might be a problem in the feedback system. The feedback system is consists of different components. But the variable resistors are frequently wear and tearable components in the feedback system. So first we gonna test the variable resistors. There is a 1k variable resistor connected in the feedback system. Let's test it with the multimeter. As you can see it is showing 2.4 kilo ohm resistance. That mean the variable resistor is not okay. Let's remove it and replace it. So I have removed the variable resistor to confirm that the variable resistor is not okay. Let's test it once again. The value of variable resistor is 2.8K which is not the required value of variable resistor. I'm gonna replace the variable resistor with a new one. So I have replaced the variable resistor. Let's test it. As you can see the output voltages are stable now. Let's adjust the output voltages. 